Weight room, weight room. Hi, my name is Erin, and today I'm going to show you the proper way to do a bicep curl and some things not to do. For this exercise, you want to make sure you have a proper closed grip on the dumbbell. Okay, you want to make sure that your hand is firmly gripped across the dumbbell in the center of the dumbbell. This is the firm gripped position. At the beginning of the bicep curl, you want to make sure you have the proper positioning. You want to make sure that your legs are spread, shoulder width apart, and that your torso is fully erect. You also want to make sure that your arms are fully lengthened and that you have a closed grip on the dumbbells, which is also called a neutral grip. They are to be by your side with your hands facing the, your outer thigh and closed tightly against your outer thigh. In the upward movement of the exercise, you are going to bring your arm up with the closed grip dumbbell four to six inches from the anterior deltoid. Your knees are going to be slightly flexed throughout the entire movement. It's important to make sure you're breathing properly throughout the exercise. When you're bringing the dumbbell into the upward motion, it's important that you inhale. And in the downward motion, we will be exhaling. So you will inhale in the upward motion and exhale in the downward motion. And now we're just going to practice that. Do the, the bicep curl by bringing both arms up or you can alternate arms. For the first set of five reps, I'm going to alternate my arms and the second set, we'll try it together. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. And now for the second set. One. Two, three, four, and five. Now this is what not to do. You want to make sure that you have a tight, firm grip on your dumbbells, because otherwise they could just fall right out of your hand. Okay, it's important that you have the same amount of weight in each hand, otherwise this one might be easy to perform your exercise, whereas this one, this one will be uneven and will pull you down. Okay, now that we're finished our reps, I'm going to explain what muscle groups this exercise works. We have our brachia, brachioradialis, our brachialis, and our biceps brachii. This exercise best works the brachioradialis muscle. Now that I've worked my muscles with these little weights, I think I'm ready to move on to the heavier ones. Pull you down. Pull you down. Strength training, fall 2008. Here we go. Weight room, weight room. Aaron loves the weight room, weight room, weight room. Aaron loves the weight room, weight room, weight room. Strength training loves the weight room. We didn't show you how to do this part of the exercise, so don't try this at home.